News 46, local coverage you can count on. Taxes at Jackson Hewitt and just found out how much he'll be getting back this year. Boy, is he happy there in the neighborhood. Want to feel as excited as Steve at tax time? Jackson Hewitt's How You Do It. No one gets you money faster. We have refund anticipation loans, and you can pay nothing out of pocket. Here at Pahrump Valley Fire and Rescue on Highway 160 and Basin, you can drop off new smoke detectors and batteries to help DJ Sproul with his Eagle Scout project. Well, my Eagle Scout project is a fire safety awareness weekend, and my volunteers and I will be working with the fire department to obtain at least 100 new smoke detectors. And after we've reached the goal, my volunteers and volunteers from the fire department will go door to door in the valley checking people's smoke detectors and if they do not have a smoke detector one will be provided for them and I'm just hoping that this project will raise awareness and prevent fires and possibly save lives. Why did you decide to do this? Well I've always wanted to do something with the fire department so the day I got my life scout my mom and I sat down we were thinking it'd be cool to do something to raise awareness and we came up with this got approved and so this is what we're doing. Lieutenant, the fire department's fully cooperating with this project. You guys are going to be out there helping them get fire um, detectors and also going in homes. Yeah, we fully support this program. Uh, we'll be uh, more than willing to help them out, whatever we need. Um, if people want to drop off smoke detectors to the main fire station here at uh, 300 North Highway 160, that'd be great. Um, yeah, and we'll be helping them uh, hook them up and, and uh, go door to door and support this program, so it's good. We're looking for batteries, too, for the smoke detectors, right? Yeah, we're also looking for the batteries. I believe it's the 9-volt batteries um, is what they need. So when does this officially start? Is it, is it on now? It is started, and we don't have a date yet for the fire safety awareness weekend, the actual mm -hmm. weekend, but we're going to do it as soon as the do donations end. How is the fire safety awareness weekend going to happen? I mean, how's what's it consist of? We're going to first get a date with the fire department. Mm -hmm. Then we are going to have a sign-up sheet. All my volunteers will be on there. Mm -hmm. Fire department will also have one, mm -hmm. I think. And are you going to have a location where people can drop off smoke um, fire? De was it smoke detectors or fire detectors? That's smoke what detectors. And um, like a different location besides Prompt Valley Fire and Rescue, are you going to be like standing in front of Walmart or, or you just want them to contact the fire department? We have two drop-off locations. One is at the Prompt Valley Auto Plaza and the other is at Car Studio in front of the Nugget. Mm -hmm. And you can donate smoke detectors and batteries there and they will both have envelopes so that you can mail monetary donations. So a, a standard home, you should have how many smoke detectors? Oh, uh, you should have one uh, in every hallway, living room. Um, doesn't hurt to have one in every bedroom too. Um, so uh, usually, pretty much every room. And nice. then checking the batteries. And checking the batteries uh, twice a year. When clock, when you change your clocks, change your batteries. There you go. This is a wonderful program. What a wonderful thing! So if people want to donate, they should just drop off new, sealed package of smoke detectors, right? Yes. And batteries. And batteries. There you go. And for more information, how can they contact you? Um, you can contact me at 775-910-3793. Thank you so much, and thank you to Prompt Valley Fire Rescue. And of course, you could keep us updated on that fire safety weekend. Yes, and if you have any questions, if you can't get a hold of uh, this young man, you can always call 775-209-5882. That's the on-duty lieutenant number, and we can uh, point you to the right direction. Thank you so much. Remember that the other locations are Prompt Valley Farm Rescue. And of course, if you need any information, you can always call Prompt Valley Farm Rescue or DJ to help him with this project. If you would like to receive a smoke detector, give DJ a call as well. This is Deanne O'Donnell for News 46.